What simple change can you make to your presentation that will greatly increase the likelihood that people will buy into your message? The answer to that question will be found in your next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom. Whether you're a speaker, presenter, or sales professional, there's a common mistake people make that hurts their chances of selling their idea, product, or service to prospective clients or purchasers. The mistake they make is they often talk more about the resource they're providing than the benefit that the client will get. For example, as a speech coach early in my career, far too often I would talk about the process I would take people through. I would tell them about how we had four sessions and, and when I'd, I would give them these videos they could watch and then we would do one-to-one -one coaching, then we would record that and all the steps. And, and people might be interested in that, but what they really wanted to know was what's in it for them. Right? That's an old cliche in the, in the sales world, and it still holds true. When I learned and internalized this concept and started using it, I saw a huge change in how people reacted to me and their willingness to buy what I was selling. Instead of talking about my resource, I would talk about the benefits to them, the increased confidence in preparing a presentation, the confidence to stand in front of a stage despite the nerves and to deliver in a dynamic style a clear and concise message that would connect with their audiences, an opening that would grab audience attention and keep them all the way to the end of the presentation, and a conclusion that would inspire people to take action on whatever it is my client was selling, product, service, or idea. The reaction to this was much more positive, and it helped me stand out from other coaches who were still talking about their resources and their process. Not that those aren't important, but they shouldn't be discussed early on. Always remember your prospective client or your prospective audience is thinking, what do I get out of this? What's in it for me? Do you understand my pain? Can you help me solve it? Those are the